I think people don't realize that it's still the number one killer in United States America. It's millions of people are affected by heart attacks, by stroke, heart failure, valve disease. Um, and so we, and about 70% of that is uh, avoidable depending on your risk factors and lifestyles and really being on top of your numbers, so to say. Following Life's Essential 8 from the American Heart Association's Presidential Advisory can keep your heart on a healthy path. Number one is exercise. Doing about 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise in a week. Number two is diet and eating habits. And a lot of uh, healthy full, whole foods, fruits, vegetables, multi-grain, um, uh, whole grain uh, breads and rice. Number three is sleep. For the average adult, getting seven to eight hours of sleep a night is pretty important. Number four is nicotine exposure. Secondhand exposure also carries heart health risk. So really taking a more comprehensive look at your nicotine exposure and making sure you're minimizing it. Number five is blood pressure. Goal blood pressure is really under 130 over 80. Number six is cholesterol. HDL is a good cholesterol and we want that to be as high as possible. Certainly above 40 is good. But then there is a non-HDL component of cholesterol and we know that different components of that are associated with increased risk of heart disease down the road. Number seven is blood sugar. We love it, we hate it. It's not great for us in, in large excessive amounts of quantities, but okay in little treats. Um, sugar, diabetes, it's a number that you can get easily checked with regular blood work at your doctor's office. And number eight is weight. Keeping an eye on the trends and focusing on the first four factors of exercise and diet will also translate into a better healthy weight.